Okay, day. <clears throat> so, I, all I have left to do is prime four, or paint 14 boxes. <clears throat> These are Quebec escape boards, so. There's 14 hives here. And next project, pollen patties. Well, I brought this bag of pollen home. Damn dog chewed a hole in it right here. Now be that black and white one called wing nut. So I have to put it in sealed containers. So I bought two five gallon brand new pails with lids. Now in this one is the, there's 12 and a half pounds for the first For the first batch of pollen patties. And it's a good thing I got two pails because this pail is just about full. <coughs> <coughs> so the next project is pollen patties. And that's 12 and a half pounds pollen powder, 25 pounds sugar, 10 cups water, 1 cup lemon juice, 1 cup vinegar oil. Mix that all up, leave it sit for 24 hours, and then you're ready for to cut the patties out. Now the paint used for 14 hives. There's two one gallons of primer, and there's about that much left in the bottom can. And we're there's the blue, white, white. There's two cans of white. And here's the current color I'm using now. And I gotta get little extensions for adding uh, sugar in the winter. So, the, these Quebec skateboards and these extensions will go in this color. I'm not sure, I'm thinking yellow for these hives. <coughs> And I'll be making pollen patties in that uh, decapper since it's never been used. So, it's been a busy time and crowded here in the living room. Building all this stuff. My shop isn't heated, so. And I gotta hit the ground running in the spring. She's going in the deep freeze for the next couple days. So, if you got dogs and you got a bag of pollen powder, watch out. Because one of them might chew a hole in it. And that's proof. So, and these are uh, entrance reducers. I'm gonna not do the side that goes to, into the bees, but the top, the side that's facing outside, and the bottom. Still gotta paint the bottom. This side is the one that goes into the beehive, so I'm just gonna leave it bare. And that about covers what I'm doing. Oh, I should say, building these uh, 38 boxes, I went through one container of carpenter glue, and that's 5,000 staples. So, the top row would be 2,500, and the bottom row would be 2,500. So, that's what I got left, out of 5,000 staples. This was full, right across to here. So, thanks for watching. I look forward to the spring.
I look forward to getting the bees out. And don't forget, stick, keep your stick on the ice. Happy New Year, everybody.